Hold them in tide water tonight. I'm your host, Roberto Lunga Rodriguez. Thanks for being here. Premier high concept late night talk show shot in the corner of a bar located in a bowling alley at Laskin Road. Yeah. <laughs> right there is an attainable record. Shoot for the stars. Uh, and I'm very excited to be here tonight. Uh, didn't think I would be. Cops are kind of jerks. Um, <laughs> I learned something today. Uh, if cops pull you over, don't pull into the nearest ghetto you can find. <laughs> they get real nervous, and a lot of them come. Um, no, it is, uh, it's awesome to be here. Uh, thanks to the camera crew, everybody working on the show. Put in a lot of hard work to make this look good. Uh, especially if you're watching on YouTube or anything, which in that case, share, like, bug all your friends, pour yourself out. I'm not above it. Why should you crank? No. No, but what are you doing? Uh, we shoot the thing at. Laura said he's with friends. Yeah, and then. <laughs> yeah, you gotta do the thing. No, that's me. Gotta go for it. Got some money, too. Yeah, go. Frank, 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 go. <laughs> raging and silent, goddamn friends. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for being here. Uh, to the spooktacular. <laughs> we scripted sound effects. Uh, that's kind of the way this uh, night's been going. Excited though that it's fall. Football season is here. Any football fans? Uh, Green Bay Packer fan. No. Uh, my host Tyrell Shackleford is actually a big 49er fan. Yeah. 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 Oh, stay standing. Don't do it like 49ers. Oh, God. <laughs> because, because, and this is completely true, by the way. Uh, Green Bay and the 49ers played two weeks Jesus. ago. Jesus. And uh, me and Tyrell had a uh, bet going on that the winner's team would write a set for that other person on the loser's team. And so to save me time from uh, writing some jokes tonight, no. and because Aaron Rodgers is such a bad man, no. the rest of this monologue will be finished by Tyrell Shot. No. It's me, your boy, Tyrell. <laughs> A.K.A. T-Dog the Laugh Master. <laughs> I'm supposed to hold for applause. <laughs> <laughs> your boy. <laughs> you guys ever how the brothers in the club dance like the... Dance like a black guy? Do the thing, Okay. It's your man. But white boy dance like this? Dance like white people? I The 757 Laugh Master. 
know what I mean, ladies? <laughs> oh, this feels <laughs> Man, you guys ever deal with the police? <laughs> that seems like a really tough job. We should respect them and all first responders every day. <laughs> Not just on 9-11. a tragic day for America, but we all came together. You know it would be funny if you were in the 80s partying with Rick James, he would be all, I'm Rick James, bitch, and punch you. And then he would say, fuck your couch. I came up with that on my own, all by myself. <laughs> this card is blank. I'm going to act like I'm reading this, but Roberto is so smart and funny and attractive, T-Dog feels dead inside knowing he must live trapped in his end. <laughs> T-Dog the laugh, the laugh boy? The laugh. The laugh. Show so we got a great lineup for you. A bunch of funny comments. Are you guys ready to do this? Woo! I love saying it every time. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Tidewater tonight. She wanted them to send them out because, like, she addressed them. 
There's an address on every letter. <laughs> you're, a psych you're, you're a post stamp boy can be a psychopath. Anyway, <laughs> so she bought those, sent them out, and so only three dudes get them. One of them, I was pissed off at Hollywood, more or less, because they are like, they just hit a dumb minority, like, black gay guy, boom, knock it out, continue on, white people. So, <laughs> lazy. And then the other two guys, like, immediately are like, we gonna fuck now, or what? <laughs> and they don't. <laughs> I mean, I jerked off to them, just know that there's no fucking nudity in it. <laughs> but, it was an alright movie, I guess. Uh, on the dick scale, it gets, it gets three dicks up. I like it.
colors or huh? is that natural now you're done? No, that's for the drums. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let, let's go. Come on, you got more. I know you got more. Horse burgers. <laughs> burgers haven't been burgers since the 50s. It's horse meat. Think about it. I guess. No. no. <laughs> is there proof or just Look at all the hooks. Where do they put horses when they die? You never see dead horses. <laughs> Let's go, another one. Come on, I'm on. <laughs> Cigarettes. Yeah. They don't kill you. They just make you look cool. <laughs> I smoked one right before I got here. You're the coolest looking good guy. Well, I know. What's that? The coolest looking good guy I know. Oh my God! Good How do you know I'm a good guy? I could also be making that up. All right, come on. You got to have at least a few more. I, I mean, I've got a couple. What do you got? All right, come on. Well, I feel like you're making fun of me now. I'm not making fun of you. Nazis. Oh, yeah. Nazis were invented by Hollywood <laughs> to sell movies with good villains and Give us awesome zombies. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you, you get one more. You get one more. All right. The, the last one's going to blow your mind. No, it will. You know that they say that the earth is round, right? Yeah. And they also say the earth is flat. They. They. I'm here to tell you the truth. You know what the earth really is? It's here. Oh, yeah, you're like all the Illuminati. Shit, yes, right? exactly. Just like the Illuminati. And speaking of the Illuminati, you guys, you guys have heard of the Illuminati, right? Yeah. Have yeah. you guys ever heard of the uh, comedy Illuminati? No, 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 no. Fuck the comedy Illuminati. The comedy Illuminati. That's that's the real fucking about the comedy Illuminati. They're trying to comedy Illuminati. The comedy Illuminati is real. Virginia Beach, greater area, possibly even Portsmouth. I don't know if they have one. Uh, <laughs> they are uh, giving me flyers every time. They have the uh, Sunday Value Club. That's uh, Sunday at 6:30. That costs us five dollars. Uh, pay that much money, you get to bowl. It's great. Uh, there was also something somebody muttered to me about a uh, Christmas bowling package where I assume you pay various amounts of money and you get different bowling options. <laughs> yes. Like five dollars to get a bowling ball, after that who knows what's coming at you. <laughs> Bowl the basketball. You guys need to work on that. We're, not gonna, we're gonna be so poor forever. You know my dad yells at me every day, right? He calls me up 6.30 in the morning, why aren't you making more money? I believe, I believe you all. And some more advertisements. Yo, Hennessy Mystery Sausage. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows what's in it? Tastes a little bit like something you might have once had, and it kind of smells a bit like crack. But anyway, it fills you up. Oh, Hennessy. <laughs> Tidewater tonight, <laughs> proudly sponsored by Candy We Found in the Garbage. <laughs> it's stuck to the side, but now put it inside. Candy We Found in the Garbage. <laughs> <laughs> oh my 
It's that time of year again. It's getting cold outside. <laughs> Tail sweeps. 87% of your dog's body heat escapes from their tail. That's scientific fact. <laughs> Keep them warm this season with tail sleep. <laughs> Not only tail sleep! <laughs> Apparently this is a thing you use. <laughs> And also, God damn it. <laughs> Kettle cooked chips. Proud sponsor of Tide Water tonight. Are they stale? Who the fuck knows? <laughs> Put them in your face. They're the only thing you have left to eat in your house. <laughs> Kettle cooked chips. Uh, I don't think we have any more sponsors. Thank God. Um, I'm going to get some spermicide, clean up my fingers, and we'll be back with more Time Wine tonight. <laughs>
months, the geese are flying south, and the elderly are heading to Florida to clog up those lanes. <laughs> but what about us? We have to stay here in Virginia and deal with the animal threat. Threat? No, but now you know, threat. Well, we're doing the community a service and bringing on an animal control specialist. Please, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Mr. Larry O'Hennessy. <laughs>
Cholesterol Specialist. Okay. Well, listen, Roberto, it changes every day, okay? Like, like I'm wearing this right now, right? But if, I, if I'm going after an animal, right, I might take my hat off, now he don't know who I am. Right? <laughs> right? Like tomorrow, I might be by a pond somewhere, I'll wear flip-flops and then butterfly wings, because I want an animal to think I'm a butterfly. Okay. Yeah. Is that religion any trouble, by the way, man of your stature and age with butterfly wings by a pond? Not at all. Not at all. <laughs> Not in this profession. You know, when you when you carry such a stature like this, uh, it's accepted. <laughs> Just let it go. I'm not going to deal with that. Okay. Okay. Um, so uh, let's say one of the uh, you do have an issue with one of the animals. Yeah. I got a pocket full. Electric pocket full. I sell these shirts, and it's a, it's a, a sausage uh, package shirt. <laughs> I got them on my website, O'Hennessy's Mystery Sausage. Mm. <laughs> Check that out, another official sponsor. <laughs> um, so, if we do, or one of the audience members, me or Tyrell encounters uh, an issue with an animal. What? Oh, a snake? Oh! Not yeah. a goddamn snake. Yeah, why not a snake? Fucking snakes, dude! Listen, uh, I don't mess with snakes, okay? I'll, I'll defer you to Steve with snakes. What's that? Yeah, oh yeah, Steve! Wait, that's Steve. the problem with snakes, that's the one you're not coming to? Him? No. You just yeah. call the guy? Yeah, yeah. Call, call Steve. Steve. That's my neighbor, I hate call him. Steve. <laughs> <laughs> when I sit back and I watch him deal with the snakes, it's funny as shit. <laughs> Every time I call Steve, he sounds surprised. Yeah. He's like, like another fucking snake. Another snake. I'm like, yeah, another yeah. snake, dude. Every time. Every uh, time. So, uh, so what is the number for uh, any of the Tide Water District's animal control specialists to call? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can give you my cellular phone number. I say get all of me. <laughs> you, don't, you don't work for any kind of... No, that's pretty like a lizard. You're a great lizard. Animal control Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, uh, Good man. I ride alone, okay? <laughs> I'm a lone wolf that hunts other animals. <laughs> All right, I mean, it's kind of, that sounds bad. It sounds like it'd be a lucrative kind of career. How much, uh, how much you make? Mm -hmm. uh, you know, put some food on the table. All right, I might have to try guru, but can I get like a ballpark of the number? Of oh, no, I mean, it literally puts the food on the table. <laughs> <laughs> you know, whatever we eat, uh, whatever I catch, that's what we eat, my family. Yeah, yeah. Listen, you can eat any animal. And I'm gonna tell you right now, that, that Dr. Randall kid you had on here, yeah, yeah fuck him, okay? <laughs> uh, because first of all, uh, birds ain't drones, and just cause he ain't caught a bird ever before, okay? Birds, birds are real. How many birds have you caught? Countless. Countless, <laughs> yeah. It's a wonder they're not extinct, okay? Uh, and then talk about that uh, uh, hamburgers on horse meat, that's horse shit, okay? <laughs> right. Wait, wait, hamburgers are horse shit, or it's horse shit that the hamburgers are horse meat? No, it's horse shit that he's saying, okay? Oh, okay. It's 100% grade A beef here in America. Woo! Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right, let's get on this rabbit hole. Jesus. Um, okay. What, uh, what's, your, what's your favorite uh, favorite animal to eat? Uh, well, let me see. I am, but before uh, we get to my favorite animal, I'm gonna tell you one animal I don't eat, okay? Uh, the opossum. <laughs> oh, yeah, the what, opossum. Why is that? Is it uh, uh, because you know, I respect that uh, dude. Any, <laughs> any animal that plays dead to stay alive, I don't mess with it. <laughs> right? That's a joke around here. So we got beef, it's already got me figured out. No matter what I put on, I put on the hemophilic pan, I put on three piece suit, okay? I put on some blue special, he knows it's me. I see opossum come across my path, tip my hat to him. <laughs> I'm wearing one, okay? Oh, of course. Yeah. And uh, so, what, so do you have a favorite animal? To, oh, yeah. Yeah. What's that? What? Uh, Is it snake? No. Oh, okay. uh, uh, you don't have a snake. Listen, will you shut the fuck up about that snake? Okay? Uh, so my favorite animal to eat, uh, you remember that red panda that escaped from the Norfolk Zoo, Sunny? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. <laughs> you you were the one who got the red panda? Listen, uh, my backpack was there. I was at the zoo, right? Just kind of saying, look, look, he might have got it in my backpack. I don't know. 